Hey guys, and welcome back to another one of my videos. So you want to make your avatar appear more cartoony or toony, however you want to say it. So today I'm going to be showing you how to do that. Do know that I'm going to be using Poyomi shaders for this video. So my first tip would be use flat shading. Now how you use flat shading is if we head over to our body material and if you extend the shading, now uh, you will see shading again and in lightning type you will see realistic but you can switch over to flat this is going to basically blend in more of the colors and hide all the shadows so basically it'll give your avatar this really toony appearance next thing you can do is use rim lighting this will be also found in the shading if you extend that and if we head over to rim lighting extend that and now uh, you, you're able to change the color depending on what you want and you can mess with these uh, settings here. Usually it's these two sliders right here. Um, this can also make your avatar look cartoony or appear cartoony. Uh, you do have to tinker with it a little bit for it to look proper, but this tool will definitely help you. The third thing you could do is use matte caps. We can also find this in shading. If we extend it and you will see matte cap here. Now where it says mask here, you're going to be using your body textures or preferably a mask if you have it something along the lines of a mission mask and then you're going to type in matte cap here and now you can use any of these materials here uh, to play around with. If you would like to see a full dive on matte caps I have a full separate video just dedicated for matte caps so check it out if you're interested in that. The next thing you can do is use an outline. Now I'm pretty sure most of you use outlines, but in case you don't, uh, it is a feature when Payomi shaders where you're able to basically put a small little outline on your avatar so that it basically appears that uh, it kind of appears like it's a drawing almost. Uh, there's few different ways uh, that you can play around with this. You can of course change its color and you're also able to have hue shift on it if you have a newer version of the Payomi. So as you can see, you can have it cycle through all these colors by basically setting a sh uh, shift speed. And the last thing that you can do is use emissions. Now, of course, I also get a thing that most of you are using emissions, but in case you are not, I would 100% recommend to use emissions uh, to even add a little bit. You don't have to go crazy, but even a little bit of light to your avatar can help and mean so, so much, especially if you're trying to make your avatar more toony this will definitely help you pull off that effect. But that would be it for this tutorial. I hope that it helped. And yeah, I'll see you around.